it was never really in question. Uh, I knew that eventually I would probably own my own restaurant. And come on. Come on. We would probably own our own restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of complement each other really well as far as our strengths. So I guess our greatest strength would be that we balance each other out. I think we look at every day as, as an event and so, you know, kind of every day that we that we that we pull it off is is a great accomplishment in our minds, I guess. The way we really look at our role in making the community a better place is just by participating in the community and keeping our business dollars local by, you know, supporting and, and purchasing our products from, you know, small local farms and producers. The farmers will come in in the morning and drop off greens from 20 minutes away and then come back after they do their other deliveries and order the menu items featuring their ingredients to take home for the night. And that's just... That's a cool feeling. You need to have a good business plan. And then you need to be able to completely abandon that plan and work with the reality around you and adapt to to what changes. We built the plan, we, we do the work, um, but there's, you know, there's a point where you can't do it all. Um, and so First National just being you know, that, that kind of ground to stand on. We see the folks every day on Saturdays, we take the dogs down to the, to the old market branch to do our change order and, and deposits. Naomi and, has special cookies. You Naomi know, has special cookies for Hank and Lil. And, um, <laughs> you know, yeah, there's, I mean, there's a, there's a, it's a big bank and it's, they've done, a, First National's done a whole lot to, to support us and prop us up, but it's also, you know, really kind of a personal relationship on a daily basis, which is cool. Basically helping us achieve our dreams. <laughs>